from the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Rebecca Schleicher with your morning headlines. Today, the community will come together to honor one of the four people killed in this year's shooting at an Antioch Waffle House. Aquila De Silva's family says he will be remembered before tonight's football game at Cane Ridge High School. De Silva graduated from Cane Ridge and then moved on to study at Middle Tennessee State University. Tonight's game starts at 6. And we are already talking about early voting again. Davidson County voters can start voting early today to decide the next vice mayor. The runoff is between Councilwoman Sherry Weiner and at-large Councilman Jim Schulman. You can vote early starting at 8 o'clock at the Metro Office Building or wait until Election Day on September 6th. With the increasing demand for services, Lebanon has opened a new fire station to help get to you a little faster. A ribbon cutting ceremony was held yesterday at Lebanon Fire Department's brand new fire station number four. It's a state of the art facility that is now home to a new firefighting apparatus and the firefighters to equip it. It is located on the corner of Highway 109 and East Division Street. Now let's get a check of the forecast with Leland. All right, thank you much right now in Nashville and around the area for today. Another warm day with area showers and thunderstorms where it rains. Some of the rain may have some local he locally heavy downpours. Highs today mid 80s. Then for tonight, we're down to right around 73 and rain chance will continue into the weekend with a higher chance on Saturday versus Sunday for now rain chances for early next week. But right now it looks like we can get a front through by Tuesday night, bringing in some drier air by Wednesday and Thursday. Have a fantastic weekend.